Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Abby Roman and I love talking about everything lifestyle based for health, fitness, beauty, all that kind of stuff. So today, as you can see, I took out my braids. If you follow me on Instagram, I've had braids in for the last couple days and my hair is pin straight. So I absolutely love having some volume, having that curly hair life, you know. <laughs> So today's YouTube video, I know it's so long overdue. I've been meaning to do this for a while, but when I did my original video, I didn't like the way my GoPro did my intro, like, you know, like when I'm just chit-chatting before going to Costco. So I'm using all the content that I did when I did go to Costco for that video that day, but I had to redo because I wasn't, you know, I'm, I'm a perfectionist and I wasn't too sold on my first little intro video. So I wanted to redo it for you guys. And, you know, why not time it when, you know, my hair is looking all fun and, you know, voluminous and, you know, just feeling all girly and pretty. So I want to coordinate, obviously, doing this to filming this part of my video and then as well as I'll still look nice for my dinner plans tonight. So on this video, it's going to be everything that I personally buy at Costco, maybe some things that you guys didn't even know Costco had, um, as well as, you know, some necessities that I just think everyone should have because one, when you eat healthy, I know it can get expensive. So I'm just suggestions on, you know, healthy produce, vegetables, all these kind of things and a little hi hidden gems that I think are at Costco that maybe some of you don't know about, just as I mentioned before. So if you wanna keep watching, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe, hit that little notification bell or button, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, let's go guys. All right guys, I arrived at Costco and I got such a sick parking spot. It is like right near the front. Look at that. <laughs> I just love when you just manifest that you're going to get a good parking spot. And without a doubt, I always get a good parking spot. So that is your trick. Uh, well, my trick that I can pass along to you that just know you're going to find a parking spot. Just keep that vision in your mind and you will always get a parking spot. I swear it works for me every time. I don't know if I just have good luck with that, but I really do believe what you manifest for anything in life really makes a huge difference with what you are able to achieve and accomplish. And uh, it starts with the parking spot. <laughs> Okay, let's go in now. Yes, guys, this music is my fave. I will flip it and show you. Let the shopping begin. Well, that was so nice. This Costco is the new market Costco. They gave you a Lysol wipe when you walked in, preventing any germs, which I thought was amazing and promoting everyone being coronavirus free <laughs> because it's really getting bad. So I'm gonna make my way first to the produce section. I always start there because it's so cold in there. I like to just get that room over with first. There's a little bit of a jam. Oh my gosh, people are going to be laughing at me filming it myself in the Costco. in these like dark places and make sure they get good expiry dates so don't be afraid to uh, go fishing in the back <laughs> all right so next are berries so I'm gonna be getting some blackberries blueberries and strawberries because I have frozen raspberries at home so yeah <laughs>
Hey guys, the strawberries didn't look that great. Um, there was only a few boxes left, so we'll be not getting strawberries today because I want to pick quality produce, and if it's not up to par for me, I'm not gonna buy it. So I'll get strawberries on my next Costco run, but I do get strawberries at Costco. Next, I'm gonna filter through and get some mushrooms. And I'm gonna go from the back. Let's check the expiry. Looks good. Okay guys, so what I wanna take note of is I always get frozen berries, but I already have a lot at home, so I don't need any more. But these are the frozen berries that are great. The organic berry berry burst I get. And there's some raspberries, organic raspberries somewhere, but the organic raspberries I always get as well because they are so good. And actually, little tip, most fruit, well, all fruit that's frozen is actually picked when it's properly ripe. So you're actually getting the best quality fruit when it's frozen. But I like to have the options of frozen and just regular raw, so yeah. You can get frozen avocado, really good. Now I got a lot of people asking me where I got the riced cauliflower from when I did post it on my Snap story on my Instagram and I got it from here. And this is the organic cauliflower rice. Oh, Lamar. I have a ton of bags of it at home so I'm not buying it because I already have lots but I want to show you guys so that you can get it too because it's really hard to find. Not all Costco's carry it. So New Market Costco, you rock, you have it. And if anyone needs it, come here. <laughs> Okay guys, so if you know me well, you know I love pancakes. And I'm gonna show you my two favorite pancake options from Costco, one gluten-free, paleo, I believe it's dairy-free as well, and the other one is not. But I've had both and I mix it up. Sometimes I'll do one company, one time I'll do the other. So this is the birch blenders. Amazing, delicious, but I already have that. I'm gonna get the Kodiak cakes. They are delicious, oh my gosh. There are the macros. I mix this with protein powder and it is so good. We're walking down the peanut butter and cereal aisle. Peanut butter I already have and cereal, well, I don't really try to have cereal very much <laughs> because it's so addictive. All right guys, so I have rice at home, but I want to show you rice that's great. Now when you're looking at your ingredient lists, you wanna always try to get the ingredients, or the get the foods, oh my God, I can't talk. Get the foods with the ingredient list that is really short. So if you can see, this ingredient list is very short. And the smaller the ingredient list, the more natural and pure the actual food is that you're getting from a packaged good. So that's a little side tip for you. Okay, so we're at my favorite section and it's the cracker section. I am obsessed with crackers. Crackers are my crackers are my kryptonite. I just love them. So I have to be very scarce with keeping crackers in the house, but I wanna get them because I haven't had them in a little while. And these are my two favorite from Costco. So the Lentil turmeric crackers are my one fave. And then these organic sweet potato crackers are my second from this brand. It's so good. So I'm gonna be getting a box of this. Grab one from here. I haven't had these ones in forever. They're so good, but they're so addictive. Oh my gosh. All right guys, this is a new find. I haven't tried them yet, but I was just looking at them. Omniflower crackers and the macros are really great they're vegan so if anyone's vegan this is obviously friendly for you and look at the ingredients so i'm gonna give it a shot give it a try can i ever have enough crackers <laughs> i'm feeling uh, super self-conscious doing all this in costco everyone's looking at me and thinking i'm talking to them I maybe mean, i'm talking to myself well to you guys and i'm talking to my gopro so get to a whole nother level of confidence here <laughs> And we're coming up to my next snack. I have more of these at home, but I'll show you them. So they are seaweed snacks. Organic seaweed snack. These are delicious as a snack for both your kids and for you if you're on the run. They are delicious. 
and their macros are amazing. And again, very limited ingredients, which is what you want to look for. So I have these at home, so I'm not getting them, but I want to show you them. And these are my addiction. So I'm not getting them today because I bought them last time I was at Costco and let's just say the whole bag didn't last more than a week. So anywho, again, these are my favorite kind of like healthier chip option. They're so good. So if you want more of a healthier option for chips at a family function or your home, if you do want something, this is my go-to as well. But I'm not buying it today. <laughs> All right guys, this is another great option. Tear chips are amazing and this is another healthier chip option to do. And these are the ingredients and the macros. So that's another option for you. So Costco is a great place. You can get a big bulk of pink Himalayan salt. Sorry. <laughs> so you have this one right here is great. You get obviously the big rocks and the grinder all in one pack. So let's just show you guys that if you want a really good find. And of course they have all the other spices in bulk garlic powder a staple i bought one last time i was at costco but amazing and look at how much you get <laughs> and then obviously all the other spices onion powder is another staple in my spice collection i use this on all my roasted vegetables that i bake delicious this one's a really good one too Lemon pepper, this one is so good on like fish, chicken, amazing. And then obviously you have all these from Clubhouse that are good on your steak or chicken too. Okay, so my next favorite thing for snack, again, I'm obsessed with pumpkin seeds, are the organic roasted pumpkin seeds. So good. So, found those. Love it. Now I'm gonna have I am recording it. <laughs> So I already have enough of my proteins. I uh, usually get obviously my chicken breast here, get my extra lean ground turkey. I get any beef stuff, like if I wanna make a filet mignon, like beef tenderloin, but I already have all those things, but I do get that stuff from Costco. And I try to stick to my fish, getting it from a fish market, just so I know it's a little bit more fresh, but I will get frozen shrimps from the frozen section at Costco. So I'm not filming that just because I already have all that stuff at home. And I just wanted to let you guys know that if you guys are wondering what protein sources I use, so I do have a variety of fish, chicken, turkey, beef. Oh my gosh, everyone's looking at me. <laughs> um, so I do get that stuff from Costco as well. And then I just use what I need and then I freeze the rest so that it's always ready. But for the beef, I don't freeze. I'm just saying for the turkey and for the chicken breast. So, okay guys, so for potatoes, I like this brand. Let me just move this stuff over. The Dynamic Duo, the little potatoes. You get a combination of your purple potato and yellow potato and they're really great for roasting, boiling, whatever. Again, I have already a huge bag because look at how big they are at home, so I don't need to get that. And I also get my sweet potatoes from Costco. Sometimes if they don't look the best, I won't get them, but they're kind of in a whole bag, so you can get that too. So I don't eat a lot of avocados, and when I do, I can't get through them if I buy them at Costco. So unless I have a recipe or I really wanna, I'm in the mood for avocados, I'll get them from the grocery store because I can't get through the whole bag. <laughs> So I just stick to getting the amount that I need from the grocery store. And I guess the next thing I'm gonna get are some peppers. I always get them from Costco. These nice big bags. And you get all the colors. My favorite actually lately has been orange and yellow peppers. Red peppers I'll eat last. I've been enjoying these ones. <laughs> Switch to the next freezer section, cold section, are the egg whites. Again, check the expiry. Good. It is the Kirkland pesto, and there are the ingredients. So even if you just do one tablespoon on your chicken, just for some flavor, that's also an option. All right, so this is the bruschetta that I get. It's awesome. Definitely great on eggs. You can put it in your salads. You can put it in any kind of stews making homemade fajitas. This is great. So I get this and you get a whole big pack. So another great condiment you can add to like your chicken breast or if you're gonna make anything with just a little bit of something extra on it. This is a great tzatziki. The macros are right there. Awesome. So 
is another great option for tzatziki if you're looking for tzatziki or any of my online clients when I put this on their programming. The one from Costco is great. All right, so we're in the hummus section. So my two favorites, well, this is the brand that I like and they have the roasted red pepper, which is great. But my favorite is the caramelized onion. It is so good. You can see the caramelized onion. Oh, you can't really see it on this one. There you go. You can see the caramelized onion in the center. You just mix it and it's so delicious. This is my favorite hummus. Okay, so for a healthy option for pop, if anyone likes that fizziness, bubbly is amazing. One of my clients got me totally hooked on it and this is so delicious. Just, I don't have it every day, but when I just feel like a little bit of something fuzzy, a little bit of something with some flavor, and then the macros for you. Really good. So this one, strawberry bubbly, grapefruit and lime, so delicious. So that's an option for, for your kids as well as for yourself for a healthy pop option. And it's $7.89 for this whole case. Woo! Hey guys, did you want to know what my addiction is? Stacy's Fita Chips. These are my kryptonite, like legit. They are my favorite. If anyone's had them before, you know. If you haven't, you're missing out. Oh my gosh, these are the best but I'll be walking away. <laughs> All right guys, so Smart Sweets, it's officially at Costco, which is amazing. This is my favorite company for like a healthy sweet option that's a candy-like thing. This is just one of the types of candies that they have. They have like a whole bunch. They have peach rings, they have like sour little gummy bears, but this one is the Swedish Fish. So if you want like a healthy sugar option for your kids, this is a great option. And there's the back of the box as well as for yourself, if you're feeling like you need something just to cut that sweet edge if you are into candy or you want something sweet. So, amazing. So all the Easter candy and chocolate is coming out. These are so good, but I will be refraining from those. Not in the cart. Abort this section, abort guys. <laughs> All these people are like, oh, what are you filming for? And I'm like, oh, for my YouTube. Yeah. So, anywho, now we're going to be heading to the checkout, which is already looking insane from the areas that I went through. So, oh my gosh, here we go. <laughs> Moment of truth, we're approaching the checkout section and it's insane. I don't know if you can see, but like it's it's mental so i'll just let you guys go and i'll check in with you guys when i get back in my car for a little recap and i need to try to get in line here so i gotta focus <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. So I hope you enjoyed my Costco little tour. I know it looks so funny that my hair is curly here and my hair was totally different and everything was totally different when I went to Costco. But as I said in my intro, I had to make two separate videos and put this video together. So that's the end result. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you think that I missed certain things at Costco that are necessities that would benefit, you know, myself as well as, as well as others, please comment below and share your tips and tricks as well because, you know, sharing is caring. We want everyone to stay healthy, especially with everything with this coronavirus and, you know, just everything in general that you want to make sure you're taking care of yourself the best you can so you live a long, long, healthy, amazing life as well as for your family and passing on those lifestyle habits to your kids so just really make sure that you are promoting those healthy eats and treats and then enjoying in balance because again we can't always eat perfect I don't eat perfect all the time some days I have pie some days I am I love crackers so my kryptonite is crackers I'll have crackers sometimes as you can see I buy them from Costco but anyways I hope you enjoyed this again please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and I will check in with you guys in my next video Mwah.